What if trees and grass could power airplanes, while cutting emissions by 80%? Sounds wild right, but stick with me. A Korean team at KISS just cracked a crazy code, turning wood and grass into jet fuel that's almost a twin to the stuff we use now. Imagine forests and lawns fueling jet engines. Here's the science, petroleum, it's all hydrocarbons. Think carbon rings and chains. Plants, they lock up carbon too but in a tough polymer called lignin. Break down lignin and you can rebuild those same hydrocarbon structures, basically turning plants into liquid energy. Now the cool part, KIST does this at room temperature and pressure, no extreme heat or industrial headaches. They use electrochemistry, lignin oil, water, a platinum catalyst and a surfactant. This combo strips out oxygen and reforms hydrocarbon rings, like naphthenes and aromatics the high energy molecules in jet fuel. Their process? Up to 98% conversion efficiency, and it keeps going strong, almost 60% yield over 100 hours, non-stop. Why does this matter? Because they use waste wood and grass, no land grabs, no food versus fuel drama. The feedstock is cheap everywhere, and the process sips energy. The result? A sustainable aviation fuel with up to 80% less carbon than regular jet fuel. Next up, Kisti is building a pilot plant to scale things up. If this gets certified and commercialized, it could help aviation go net zero by 2050. Trees, powering our flights? Welcome to the future of flight.